Hey everybody, Spidey Geo 9 here, and I hope you're having a marvelous day. I tell you what, I had no idea how much of a treat I was in for today, but I drove up to El Dorado, Arkansas, actually some old stomping grounds of mine uh, that I lived here for a brief time at age 15, 14 and 15, to come to Gabe's Cave. And guess who I got with me? I'm Gabe. <laughs> and they have the most amazing store and if Gabe's open to it, I'm actually going to do a separate video and just show off this store because it's so incredible. It's fun. I've literally been in awe since I've been here. But what's really cool, and even though they have comics and statues and action figures and assortment of other things, they also have Marvel trading cards, which is just difficult to find in comic book stores nowadays. Yeah. It's been really hard. And so while I was here, I was like, you know what? I got to buy some stuff. And Gabe, who has a YouTube channel, I think this this store actually was born out of a YouTube channel. It was. Right? And it's by the same name, Gabe's yes. Cave. So check it out in the link in the description below. And I thought, hey, I want to open these right now. I don't want to drive another hour and a half, get home and then have to do it. I want to do this right here in their sweet studio. Because look at these, uh, look what we got going on. We got Spider-Man behind us, some other cool stuff. Hulk 181. Hulk 181 is so sweet. Uh, is that for sale? Yes, yeah, <laughs> there yeah. might be some of these up there for sale at one point, but right now, you know, yeah. we'd have to get something cooler. So cool. Love the Galactus behind me. But we're going to open up some trading cards. So I've got some old school, well, kind of old school. These are still considered modern. 2012 uh, Marvel Greatest Heroes. A Hershey bar. <laughs> yeah, it looks like a Hershey bar. But don't eat it. I wouldn't recommend it. Yeah, then we have Star Wars Holocron. We got a single pack because I'm a gambler. And then we have a box which should have a guaranteed auto per box. And I hear a rumor that there's some pretty special autos still remaining to be hit. I hope so you get it. <laughs> I really hope you do. <laughs> right. So we're gonna start with the uh, with the Marvel cards. Now, Gabe, do you collect Marvel trading cards at all? Uh, I don't really collect trading cards. Um, I, t I get art cards every once in a while if I like them enough, but like I don't. I don't always uh, collect trading cards. Now, when you say art cards, you mean one of one sketch cards? Yes. Now, I, I, as I was looking through the store, I noticed that you guys happen to have like commissioned art cards that are on a card stock for Gabe's Cave. Yeah. So those are our series of art cards that we give away every week for free, entirely every, free. Every week? Every week. Now, so I have a, you know, it's a small channel. It's about, 1100 subscribers mm -hmm. the vast majority of them are subscribing because of marvel cards and so guys make sure you check out gabe's channel because he's literally giving away one of one original art art cards from pretty big artists right yeah like um candace daly seth grove <laughs> uh tone rodriguez um, oh they got one of spidey gwen up there that is just i'm just drooling over and they won't sell it they want to give it away so I'm going to create multiple YouTube accounts and subscribe over and over again. To you know, them. I've actually offered that idea <laughs> because we're not allowed to enter giveaways, sadly. Oh, but look at that. that cards a, all go, y'all. That's a great looking card. Yeah. So I've only ever opened like one pack of these in the past uh, just by chance, but they're pretty sick. I'm liking them. This is actually the checklist. You got all these artists on it, all these characters, but it's the checklist. There. Now, do you know if these have sketch cards in them? The 2012? I actually don't. I have no idea. Now, That's one I haven't really looked at. I know my brother collects the Holocron series and he looks for sketch cards and autographs. Um, actually, one series of trading cards I do collect was the Mortal Kombat series. Really? Yeah. And I, I'm pretty sure I have the full collection now. Oh, now, does it have sketch cards in them? Uh, no, it's it's old trading cards, like for the original uh, arcade games. Oh, so I was yeah. a I was a big first and second generation Mortal Kombat uh, player. You know. Oh. Yeah, we have um, the like the plywood ones you can buy at Walmart. Uh huh. We have one of those, and it it's like the it's got one, two, and ultimate. So, Ooh. do you like playing those old ones? Oh yeah. What's your favorite Mortal Kombat game? Um, I love the old ones, but I have to go with modern ones. Sure. I mean, there's just so much more it's going just, on. Yeah, it's... I don't know if I'd like one more than the others, though. 
So have you seen Eternals yet? I have not. I am not sure when I'm going to see it. Okay, this is different. What's going on here? It's got a different texture to it. And art by Mark Bagley, Morgan Le Fay. Interesting. So it's like a print. Yeah. It's, it's like, like a print of somebody's art like that. It is, but it's got a whole different texture compared to the other cards. It's some kind of sub-series, I suspect. Yeah. This is really cool art. I always say, anytime you put a moon in the background of anything comic book related, it's just... It looks great. It looks great. It does. Whether it's Batman, Daredevil, Spider-Man, Venom, Black Cat, it doesn't matter. Any kind of planet. I agree. All right, so one more pack of these, and then we're going to get into the Star Wars, which I'm really excited about. I've only ever opened... Well, I guess I've opened two boxes of Star Wars products. But one of them, a friend opened for me online. My brother used to buy the crap out of them. Why'd he stop? Um, I don't think he has. He just doesn't buy as many anymore. He has other priorities. All right, so we hit an insert Ooh. of some kind. I am an Avenger. Uh, but not sure what type of insert this is. Captain America and Shroud. So next, we'll move on to our Star Wars. How's it going? How's it going? We've got one pack here, and then we're going to go into the box. So should we open the pack first or the box first? Pack. Go straight from the pack. Okay. Now, what if we hit an auto on one pack? Do we even open the box at that point? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because that's like a, isn't it a guaranteed autograph? Yeah, one per box. So. I mean, I guess nothing's really guaranteed, but it should be. I think it says on that. Should be. By the way, I'm Justin. I'm Darren. Darren, nice Together to meet you, man. Yes. That's awesome. Look, uh, they're letting me open some of our product that we just bought. If you do, I'll give you a, a, a sleeve. If you get something good, I'll give you a sleeve and a top loader. For Sweet. I've been, I've been hoping someone comes in and opens stuff up on. Sweet. Do you want to join us? No, it's good. I've got to, I got to be in here. <laughs> Sweet. I, I'm excited for it. I'm we'll show you what we get. Yeah. We talked yesterday on the yeah. phone. Sweet. I didn't quite get here at 10 a.m. So, no, you're good. I was hoping I'd be here when you got I had here. to go to UPS, and I looked up a UPS here in town. There's not one. There's not one on Saturday except some kind of drop-off inside of an advanced auto. There's not a UPS here at all. And I was like, well, dang. There's so, a delivery, but not really a drop-off anymore. Yeah, so I had to I had to call an audible and do that. So, Well, Darren, it's nice to meet you. Y'all got Thank a you. wonderful place here. Thank you. I'll, I'll, be, I'll, I'll be in here. Whatever y'all are done, I'm yeah. excited to see what you get. Yep, yeah, we'll bring it to you. All right, so we've got pack number one here. Uh, not of the box, but the loose pack. We're gonna go through these like this. And look, we're just, we're gonna move through here quickly because we're looking for sketch cards and autos. I like the Bosque though. The Bosque is cool. Okay, what do we have here? We've got some type lightsaber. of lightsaber. Yeah. Is that Clone Commander? Okay. We've got some kind of- no, it's just troopers. Ooh. Foiling effect, reflector effect. That's a holocron. Well, that just says N1. All right. I have not studied this series, so I don't know what I'm looking at here, but we're going to set that one to the side. And oh, one of my favorite Jedis. Qui-Gon. Qui-Gon Jim. Space Jesus. <laughs> space the, Jesus. The real space Jesus. I haven't thought about that before. Uh, so I actually just got, I have a twin brother named Dustin, and just got him to start listening to the audible of Darth Plagueis. Hmm. Have you ever read that or listened to it? I have not, but I did look up a ton of stuff on it. It is so good. It, it really brings to life episodes one, two, and three. I read a bunch of summaries on it, and I've read a, uh, uh, listened to a bunch of stuff on it. Sweet. So. All right, so we've broken the seal. You know what that means. The value's gone. Now we're completely at risk to what's in this box. And the hope is, is that... Uh, it's worth it. Yeah, that's worth it. We're going to hit something special. Now, Dave, do you want to open some with me? If you don't mind. I don't mind at all. There you go. Grab some. There you go. We'll, uh, we're going to double up on these packs because, again, we're primarily just looking for those that, that make Which, if you didn't know, you can uh, tear it down the middle of the Oh, scene. I like it. That's how we always open them. Dave is teaching me something. So, all right, so you, you know how to open these up in a very special way. Do you also grade cards? Um, 
like our business or you individually and your business uh we do not but we can't we're setting something up to be able to send them off for you um problem is Grading on cards is a two-year wait right now. Right, yeah. everybody found out, hey, <laughs> there's some original Pokemon series that are worth money yeah. if they're graded at like a nine. So everybody and their mom sent in their whole collection at once. <laughs> yeah. Didn't look at prices so or did I. <laughs> I'm one of those guys. Yeah. I so, sent in like 123 cards. I'm still waiting on Which like half of them aren't even worth it. There are <laughs> just a few select few, but you know, why not? Yeah. It's fun though. It's fun. All right, I'm gonna move through these. I do like this this image of Luke, though. Not gonna lie. Ooh, and I'm a huge fan of Ahsoka. Oh, that's sick. Huge fan. Quill. This is the way. All right. How do we know if it is the auto? Uh, <laughs> it should be. It should say it or something. Well, I mean, I understand. That, like, I'll be able to see the signature, but I'm kind of curious if I can like pull back and like save it for the last hit. Okay, we got Yoda. To go with Anakin. Of course I'm. Of course I'm. Sweet. So, do you like doing any kind of betting or anything like that? Like what I said, mean? I have like, hey, I bet that, uh, okay. that if I pull the auto, you got to give me one more pack of these holocrons that you got up there. But if you pull the auto, I got to buy one more pack. I don't think I'm... <laughs> You're allowed to do in, that? I don't think I am. <laughs> Are you over the age of 18? I'm not. So he can't gamble, guys. Yeah. So that answers the question. <laughs> Vice Admiral. Ooh. Darth Maul. You got a, you got a Sir Christopher Lee. Oh, man. If that was an auto. <laughs> yeah. This is Ren. I love that there's a lot of depth to the characters in these cards. Space but, Jesus too. So this one's got some interesting green effect on the side. So do you, yours yeah. does too. Yeah, I have a few like that. Okay. Um, Ooh, but mine's got, not reflective like that. We got Pip. Amandala. Pip. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, that's sick. Clone animated. Wars Mall. Yeah. Animated Clone Wars that's Darth Maul. Nice. I love it. And Mustafar. That's a trap. <laughs> a trap. Scenes. Yeah. In the scenes. Hey Dave, do you have any brothers or sisters? Uh, Darren is my brother. Darren is your brother. He's yeah. the older brother. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, me, my brother, and my dad are the owners. That's sweet. That's really sweet. And Ooh. then Brandon, who showed you around in here, was he's the manager. He's the manager. Yes. That's really cool. I thought they were like thicker cards if it's a uh, hollow or if it's the uh, not the hollow the uh the auto signature yeah so we might be able to tell that way yeah i think really like commander cody oh yeah you have i love his armor you have a commander cody action figure in there i was eyeballing uh oh Dinjar. who's that uh dengar darth vader oh oh you hit it uh-oh Oh, this is a sketch card. <laughs> All right, we're going to save this for last. We're going to save that one for last. That's really so, cool. So, it's not an autograph. It is a sketch card, though. I mean, it has an autograph. It has an autograph. But. Uh, at first, all I saw was the autograph. We're going to. <laughs> and Ahsoka Tano and her first lightsaber. Love it. Love it. Which, did you watch the animated series? Yes. You yes. watched Rebels, too? I haven't finished Rebels. Okay. Have you got to Ahsoka yet? No. Okay. And I and I know I need to. Like I understand. Like that's why I haven't been able to like really. really Have get you into seen it. any of the stuff of her at all? Oh, like yeah. in her new. You've seen Mandalorian. Right? Oh yeah. Okay. Love it. So you know her new lightsabers. They're not her old ones because she dropped those at the end of Clone Wars. Right. Right. So did you know? Fun fact here. Okay. That her lightsabers, the new ones, she took off of an Inquisitor and purified, I think. I did not know that. And she, that's why they are white. That's why they're white. And she knows a Jedi either. She considers herself a great Jedi. Have, we have our, uh, our auto. Do you? Yep. We're going to set it to the side. Set it to the side with the sketch card. Uh, getting a sketch card and an auto in the same box, I think, is pretty special. That's, that's pretty good. Hey, you could get more sketch cards. Oh, 
That would be awesome. That, I think you can. I might be wrong on that. Don't quote me. That would be but, cool. Hey, more sketch cards. That's cooler. <laughs> Asajj Ventress. Ooh, Asajj is cool. Oh, so you pulled the sketch card. I pulled the auto. That's pretty cool. Yeah. We split that. I don't think anybody would have won that bet. No, we would have both lost. No, we would have both won. Yeah. Which would have been one of us losing. How does that work? Um... <laughs> We both get a pack? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, C3PO. I mean, R2D2. Sorry. R2D2. Young Anakin. There's a, there's a lot of depth to these cards. I mean, they go back to the originals and to... The Sith Lord himself. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, Jar Jar is the Sith Lord. I actually bought an extra Jar Jar to put a black Sith robe on him. So we had a chance to buy a life-size Jar Jar. Did y'all really? Life-size, full-size. Well, I'm glad you went with the Surfer instead. We, uh, well, no, we already had the Surfer. Okay. But we had the chance to buy a life-size Jar Jar. We chose not to. We didn't feel like it was worth it. <laughs> but. Well, I mean, he's so polarizing. You know, either people love him or hate him. I think the Yoda... It, you know, just hits everybody right where they want to. Oh, Han. Be. Han, yeah. And I'll chill. You got two packs left. Geonosis. Keep it even. Oh, kind of. I'm actually still going to pack for me. But, uh, no, no. There's going to be one extra. There's going to be one extra. Got it. No matter what. Unless there's more in the box. <laughs> no, the box is empty. I checked. Leia. Ooh, Boba Fett. Yeah. Ooh, young Ezra with his first lightsaber. Very cool. Oh. A lot of people don't care for Ezra. I mean, this has everything in it. Yeah. I yeah. Have... You might make it out with all the characters. Django, yeah. <laughs> I mean, from Rebels, Clone Wars, episodes one through... Hey, Inquisitor. What is this? Which brother is this? Fifth brother. That's right. Fifth brother. Sith Strong Trooper, or Sith... Trooper? Sith Trooper. Sith Trooper, yeah. And then Yoda and his saber. I wasn't expecting to get Pal. Huh. I don't think a lot of people ever do expect to get him. No, but there's Grievous. I think we've gotten a sketch card of him before. Oh, cool. like that. Another Boba Fett. Oh, look at that. That's cool. Kind of a... Refractor style Boba. That's nice. Pretty cool is Yoda. Is this Exit. Yeah, Exigo. Palpatine. Just the Emperor. So, where does Star Wars rank for you in, like, uh, in comparison to, say, Marvel, DC? Um, I like Star Wars more. Um, and then it just depends on what from Marvel and DC. Well, I'm obviously a huge Spider-Man fan, but I do love me some Star Wars. Holographic Vader. Oh, sweet. We're hitting all the big characters for the holographs or whatever they call them. Obi-Wan and his saber again. All right, we're both down to one pack. This is our pack battle. Will we get another? I don't think so. But... Who will get the best card? Oh, okay. We're just seeing who gets the best? Yep, who gets the best? You've already beat me. I got Django. Django's pretty cool. He is cool. Oh, the Grand Inquisitor. This roll. Oh, you've got two cool ones. I do. And Vader. Hey, oh, yeah. That, yeah, Rex. It, Rex is really cool. We haven't pulled him yet, so that's yeah. really sweet. Oh, man, this pack is oh. lit. Who, who's Savage that? Oppress. Savage. He's oh, pretty dude, cool. I got Mando. I don't know. I think Django is better than Mando. Do you really? Yeah, I do. And I got General Leia. I got uh, serendipity at the cantina. Okay. I uh, I like Rex. So I like let's Rex see. too. Let's see. I'm going to pull out my best car. We're going to compare it. Compare it. You know, because I haven't seen a Mando in this whole pack unless you pull one. I'm going to I'm gonna have to go with Mando. So. My vote is uh, my card's Rex. 
Oh, that's a tough decision. And right? it's, oh, no, not only Rex, it's phase one Rex. Oh. It's not even his uh, phase two cut up mask. It's the phase one. So from the, <laughs> from the Clone Wars movie, whenever they were, uh, when you meet Ahsoka Tano for the yeah. first time. That's, that's I pretty think, cool. I think Rex is a, is a uh, crowd favorite. People love Mando, but Rex yeah. is, is special. So I'm going to have to give New, it to you with Rex. Newer people do like Mando more. They do. This is because they don't know. Yeah. They haven't watched Clone Wars yet. Exactly. They haven't gotten to the good stuff yet. That's the issue. The All right. stuff. So we're going to do, we're going to do the sketch card first. I haven't even seen the autograph. <laughs> yeah. I caught a glimpse of it. Yeah. All right. So here it is, guys. Boom. It's pretty cool. That is really sick. A lot going on there. It's by. It's uh, Darren. Dar Darren. Is that it's Darren. Pepe? I think Pepe. Pepe. I probably should have shown the auto first. I but, did actually. You, you should yeah, because I slid it down and I was like, oh. "Okay." Well, I think that what I like about this card is it, it is really a full sketch. It's not quite a whole body, and there's a lot going on in it. But the character, I'm trying to remember who this is. Um, it's from uh, one of the new sequels. Okay. You remember the um? They meet the the chick. The um, she was a, a trooper also. She used to be in Finn. Connection. Oh, that's right. Yeah. There at or the end. Right it's at the that end. or she, or that's from a Han Solo movie. Okay. Han, it might be from Han Solo too. Yeah. I can't think. We'll have to do some research. If I figure it out. Darren will know. We'll put it up here somewhere. All right. So the first thing to look at back here is what is number two. So it's number to 99. And flip. Gonna do it this way from the bottom. Oh, who is that? That is the um, banker, Rush the banker. Clovis. Yeah, that's the claim. chick that Padme uh, liked, kind of. The dude and not chick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Such plans I had. No, I've spent so much of my life misunderstood. What will they say about me now? Clovis, you have to turn yourself in. It's over, Clovis. I'm not the villain here. Tell him, Padme. I'm sorry, Padme. You're okay. I'm sorry, Anakin. I'm sorry. <laughs> the dude and, that Pat uh, made light. And, uh, you know, Anakin beat up. Yeah, he got pretty, Fist, uh, he got got pretty upset. Yeah. yeah, he was pretty upset about that. They were, Fisticuffs. Today. They were having dinner together. He was mm -hmm. kind of putting the uh, woo on her. I remember that now. It's yeah. been a while since I've seen that. So Rush Clovis and the actor is Robin Atkins Downs. Robin Atkins Downs. So uh, not the auto we wanted to hit but still fun to get both an auto and a sketch in one box. So, man, pretty cool. Gabe, dude, this has been awesome. I really appreciate you. Remember to check out uh, their channel, Gabe's Cave. If you're in South Arkansas, drive. No, we, you can't fly in here. But we do drive. have a, you can't, there's an airport here. There is. Of. Yeah, it's a little bit out of town, but. So you have a private jet. <laughs> <laughs> fly in. <laughs> it's worth it. Uh, you could probably go to Dallas and then here. We all have a Facebook page. I've seen that. We do. We have an Instagram, which it's all, I think, Gabe's Cave. Mm -hmm. We have YouTube, of course, and then uh, a TikTok. Sweet. You gotta check the TikTok out. We have the brick and mortar location. And also, if you check it out, um, like a week or two ago, I think, was the video that we showed off the cave. It's me and Darren acting stupid for a bit and <laughs> showing off the cave. So Awesome. Awesome, guys. Hey, well, thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Thank you. I, I'm going to have to try not to drive here every weekend. This has been a lot of fun. All right, guys. We're out. No, have a marvelous once a day. Once a, once a week? Yeah, pick up comics. Yeah, Weekly comics. Right. <laughs> All right. Have a marvelous day, guys. Bye. Bye.